Remove the source and HPLC tubing. Unscrew the brass nut to remove the ESI probe. Remove the black locking nut and pull out the capillary holder. Please note that there is a spring under the holder so make sure this is removed as it can fall out. Take a quarter inch spanner and loosen the black backing nut and unscrew it fully and remove the old electrode. Slide the new capillary into the backing nut and replace the backing nut into the ZDV connector, allowing the capillary to fall down into the ZDV to get to the correct position. Then tighten the backing nut to finger tight and using the quarter inch spanner give it a quarter turn. Replace the spring into the top of the probe and then reinsert the capillary into the probe being careful not to bend the capillary. Replace the black cap but don't fully tighten it. Put the probe back into the source and tighten the brass nut. Now adjust the black cap and have the capillary protruding by 1 to 2 mm. Finally replace the source.